Hey guys, um, welcome to this video. Um, this is actually my first video on this channel. You are watching Tech Monster. Um, and in this video, I will be comparing the older AirPods and the newer AirPod Pros. I'll be talking about the looks, the price, um, the comfort, and just what I think overall about the products. First of all, let's start with the looks. Uh, the older AirPods have more of a rectangular type of shape where the newer ones have more flatter shape and overall the size is just a bit bigger of the old of the newer ones so it opens up like horizontally similar to something you would see maybe on the sorry about that on the Sony or Sony uh, wireless earphones or the Samsung Buds similar to that it's more flat now and you open it on the flat side compared to a more taller or more equal to a shape on the sides. Um, comfort wise they're both really good um, obviously they both have different ear tips on the end um, the older ones have just a regular ear tip that you would find on wired uh, Apple earphones and the AirPod Pros have this new advanced ear tip where there's actually a silicone silicone part where you obviously gives more grip um, but what I've seen over time is that the grip actually goes off a little bit like after like maybe a few weeks for like a month or something like that the grip actually reduces and it actually seemingly gets worse in terms of staying in your ear compared to the older AirPods um, but it still stays in your ear as long as you can get the right size in. Obviously, uh, the AirPod Pros have more technology in it. Um, like you can have three modes, like uh, like noise cancelling mode, um, transparency mode, and just a normal mode. Um, you can't have any of that on the regular AirPods. Um, and noise cancelling pretty much if you listen to music or podcast maybe and you just don't want to hear the noise around you you would just put it into noise cancelling mode which is very easy now you just hold it on the stem um, for until it makes a click it's actually not really a click it's just it's a sound of a click that comes in one of the year whichever one you press it in and that's what activates the noise cancelling and if you want to disable it you do the same thing and it goes back to transparency so the noise cancelling will block out any sound, not all of it, but most of it, um, in wherever you're listening in. Um, and transparency will be like pretty much you're not wearing anything, it's just however you hear normally. Um, the AirPods on the normal, regular AirPods on the other hand, uh, doesn't have any of that as I said. It's just regular, no transparency, no noise cancelling, but that comes with uh, but that new technology on the airpods comes with the price which i will be talking about later audio quality is the main thing that you would want to find um on airpods or any uh earphones um on the airpod pros they you would expect them to be more advanced by far but it's actually not that big of a difference um the airpods um, the regular AirPods and the AirPods Pro, obviously there is a bit of a difference and the audio quality, like if you're listening to music or something, is better, tiny bit, um, on the AirPods Pros, but it's not that big where you'll be like, oh, I can't bear this or anything, it's fine. If you still have AirPods, uh, the, no the quality is fine. Um, the, however, the mic quality, I think there's a big difference there, um, especially like if you're on calls, you connect by Bluetooth, you would want uh, the app, obviously, for other people to hear you well. Um, the AirPod Pros does a really good job at that. Like, you can, uh, the person on the other side of a call can hear you very well, it's really clear compared to the older AirPods. Um, and that's because, well, mainly, the AirPod Pros come in at $399 Australian dollars, which is much more compared to the regular AirPods, which come out at $249 Australian dollars. 
that's like a hundred and fifty dollars um, difference obviously Australian dollars um, so if you want the new features the new technology and the little bit better sound then you would go with the newer airpods but if you have the older airpods already or you're looking for something that's still sturdy that's still good that can be used on a daily basis then you could probably go for still go for the older airpods even though they're not really older they apple still sell them as a cheaper version um, so obviously it'd still be a, still be easy to find them if you go to any Apple store or any retailer, maybe in Australia like we have JB High Five, something like that, you could find them. Uh, and yeah, pretty much uh, it's not the biggest upgrade, but obviously there is an upgrade where you, when you change over, you do feel it. That's all I had to talk about today. I hope you enjoy, enjoyed this video. Um, don't forget to subscribe and like this video down there. And see you next time. Bye.